said he wasn't going to send it. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. I apologize that I did not post this week. I am currently back in Nebraska, back home with the fam bam. So I just had a super busy week. Didn't have time to get a video made, unfortunately. But today, we are going boating. We're taking the boat out for the first time this season. And I want to get some drone shots. However, drones don't float. So I'm going to Walmart right now to get a pool noodle. And I'm going to fix that. That way, if it does crash, at least I can go grab it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you know what I'm saying. Step one, pool noodle. Color may vary. All right, so the next part is going to be the most important part. You're going to need to get your drone, fold it out. We're going to need to measure the legs so we can see how long we need to cut of tubing so we can make these things float. Good. Looks like the legs are about nine inches long. So now we've got two pieces cut. It's almost like a pontoon boat. Should we go ahead and open up the leg? that on, throw on the other one, alright, so you take these bad boys down, and there you go, you got your pontoon drone, now if you're getting a lake shot and this thing falls out of the sky, hopefully it'll float so you can come grab it, uh, just got to test the landing gear, make sure it still lands, and then I'm going to go upstairs and test it in the bathtub before we take it to the real thing, here's the initial flight with the water landing gear. Hopefully I don't crash it. I'm a genius. I'm switching my major to engineering. Alright, so we got one more final test before I feel comfortable flying that thing over the lake. We're filling up the bathtub right now. We're going to fill it up with water and then I'm going to slowly put the drone on the water and make sure that it will float. Nope. <laughs> That's not going to do anything. I guess we're just going to have to risk it. Alright guys, we finally got the boat ready to go. It is time to head to the lake. Signs. 